Hello and welcome back to Fallout New Vegas. Here's truly Lord Zindri the Man. We shall slowly make our way back to Elder McNamara because we have reports. Three of them, one saying that. Uh, well, most of them are saying that the NCR is not as up to strength as they used to be. Or at least that the grasp on this particular region is not very good. That's the way we need to go. Alright. Hello. 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 Have you had any luck finding the scouts? Or did you have something to discuss? Here are the reports. Good. Let's take a look. Hmm. If I'm reading this right, it appears that the NCR's grip on this region is nowhere near as firm as I thought. I'll have to review these in detail, but these reports have given me much to think about. Thank you, Outsider. You've become someone I can count on, so I believe I can share something rather confidential with you. Go on. The device that creates the sandstorms above, that masks our comings and goings, was only intended to be used in case of emergencies. It was never meant to be used with any regularity, and the other systems here were not designed to accommodate such usage. In particular, the air filtration system simply cannot handle the quantity of sand and grit that it's been forced to cope with these last few years. As a result, the system is failing, albeit slowly. I'm told we have a scant few months before it shuts down completely. Should that happen, it will quickly become impossible to breathe here in the bunker. Already the air quality begins to slightly worsen. I would like you to find the components we need to fix this bunker's air filtration system. I cannot overstate the importance of this task. See Senior Knight Lorenzo for the details. He's the one who brought the matter to my attention. And the only other person who is aware of it. Alright, uh, can we talk about something else? Back again, I see. Have you found all the components we need? Uh, no, I have some questions. I can spare a little time. What did you want to talk about? Uh, what is with that crazy sandstorm on the surface? That is this base's defensive system. It serves as camouflage and masks all entry and exit from the bunker. We use it to hide our patrols and supply runners. Though we still send such out at night to be extra safe. Didn't go to lockdown? It's a protective measure that was enacted after our defeat at Helios. The NCR was hot on our heels and we wouldn't have survived another encounter. It was decided that we would stay quiet for a time, heal the wounded, and try to come up with a new strategy. However, after we had fully recuperated, our first scouting measures showed that the NCR's presence in this region had only increased in our absence. There are now more than five times the number of NCR troops in the area as when we fought them. And we have half the number we did at Helios. And so the lockdown has been extended. To go outside would be the death of us all. How do you get supplies? We have some personnel that are allowed to travel on the surface. They trade for what we need and occasionally drop off what they acquire. We make sure that they only enter or leave the bunker while the sandstorm is active, to avoid detection. Uh, except uh, the sandstorm wasn't that, not active when I've been entering the place, okay. Bye. Back to Lorenzo we go. I wonder uh, how the work on ED is going. I don't really see why we needed armor. Maybe I should have gone for weapons. But on the hat, other hand, it wouldn't have mattered because it doesn't affect the uh, reputation with either faction. Hello, outsider. Okay, where is Lorenzo? How may I assist you? You're not Lorenzo. You're not Lorenzo. You're not Lorenzo. You. You're not Lorenzo either. Don't tell me he's fallen through the I floor. Heard some special squad. It might really be a matter of uh, him not being here until he is. Edie has returned. Okay, Edie has returned to Brim, so maybe Lorenzo is back? Let's take a look. 
You're being watched, so don't get any ideas. Yeah, there we go. Good to see you again. What can I help you with? Uh, the other wants me to retrieve components to help fix their refrigeration system. So now I'm going to have your death on my conscience too? Great. No, I have Edie. Maybe you misheard me? No, I heard you quite clearly. You're being sent off to be killed like the others. You think you're the first person the Elders trusted with this? He sent three of our patrols out looking for those components and they're all dead. I was the one who supplied the Elder with the location of possible sites where we could find the components, so... Their deaths are my fault. And now it's your turn. Well, don't say you weren't warned. I won't take the blame when you die horribly. But I can tell you're getting impatient. The items I'll need to keep the system running are a differential pressure controller, a reverse pulse cleaner, and several HEPA cartridge filters. At present, my best guess for finding the items would be to search any of the old vaults in the area. Those vaults were usually built much like these military bunkers, even using the same contractors in their constructions at times. I'll mark the vaults' locations on your map. Best of luck to you. Oh, thank you. Alright, first of all, we're going to Brimda. For obvious reasons. Hello, hey. Scribe Ibsen, who are you? Look, this isn't a great time. Oh, what the hell? It's not like we're making any progress. I'm Ibsen, and I hope your day is going better than mine is. Something wrong? Yeah, I'm in charge of keeping this data system up and running, but accessing it is a little, uh, touch and go at the moment. Need help? I could use some assistance, sure, but I highly doubt you have the technical background to help us deal with this virus. Uh, the virus? Yeah, some pre-war jackass with too much time on his hands apparently decided to inflict his misery on those around him. It's scrambling all the terminals here at the moment. Luckily, we only use this section for storing historical data. Anything I can do to help? I suppose it couldn't hurt to get another pair of eyes on this. Maybe you'll be able to come up with something coming at it fresh. While the entire system is infected, the virus itself is spread across three terminals. The problem is that it keeps moving periodically. We'll have it nailed down in a terminal or two, only to have it jump to another set of terminals before we locate the third. Can't the, vi can the virus file speed partitions so read access is only provided by the governor administrator? What? No, that... that's brilliant! It would let us seal a portion of the virus to a particular terminal, even when the other parts move. I get to try then. Best of luck to you. I'll tell the others to take a break so they don't get in your way. Oh, and I'll keep track of when it jumps for you. To maximize your chances, wait for my signal before you begin. You're being watched, so don't get any ideas. Well? But then you click and lock them down, so I'm not gonna be a problem. Okay, this doesn't appear to be. The virus just jumped. Find which terminals it went to. That's apparently not the one I can use. Rex, don't push me. Petition virus. Nice. Then, uh, okay, 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 ten seconds. Partition virus, okay. So, okay, that's it. We got it. The virus has been purged. Hello, outsider. You actually did it? If you don't mind my saying so, I didn't think you had a chance in hell of pulling it off. But I'm glad to be wrong for once. Thank you, my friend. Please feel free to access the data store at your leisure. I'm only allowed to give you access to non-classified topics, but it's better than nothing, right? Huh. Alright, I'll see you later. Bye. Not gonna bother delve into politics right now. The bunker takes a little getting used to, doesn't it? Maybe. Alright, uh, this should be the way out, so let's take it. Huh. And then. I'm going to have to start hunting down walls. Fascinating. 
I haven't actually done any vault hunting in a while. I don't think we have done any vault hunting in this particular series. No, we only... We only visited that one vault in New Vegas, didn't we? I think it's true. So... The locations given to us are Vault 11. That's pretty close to the trading post. Vault 22 and... Huh. South Vegas Ruins. Interesting. I think we'll start there. Right then. Uh, what way was it? South? West. So this should eventually get me, you know, light with the Brotherhood or something like that. At least accepted, maybe. Because currently, they still think of me as uh, that one guy who keeps stopping by at times. But we need them to light us. Because I'm quite sure that is actually relevant for if you want to make friends with them. If not friends, at least, you know, like that acquaintanceship thing. Is that... What is that facility over there? Oh, we found about 11. Good. It's as, it's as if that was what we were looking for. Right. From me. Got to really do anything here. Wait. This seems to be a very insect heavy area at the moment, so we might as well use a sword. Not even sure we got to kill anything, but you know. Hmm? I can hear more bugs. Rex opened the door to find more bugs. That's a rat! That explains why we Rex was so eager to get here. Yeah. Right heading down. Rex, why are we hunting mantises when we have rats? Right, check in here. Empty lockers. And a non-empty locker. Nice. Still particularly used this day. Public terminal, what do we have here? Election guide. Diff, follow, more dweller. Congratulations, your dedication to the democratic process is the bedrock upon which the continuation stability, continuous stability of Vault 11 is based. Now, to help you make your decision for this year's election, the Coalition of Vault 11 Voting Blocks has put together this handy dweller's official guide to obtaining overseers democratically. Or do good. That contains a summary of the leading candidates for overseer as well as their statements, key positions and most important importantly endorsements. Sincerely Roy What yep. Oh well. Uh da -da 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 -da. lots of things. Yeah, I don't think we need to be that worried about their politics. I think they're dead. But at least I think they've left the place behind. So the democratic system didn't last long here. Oh, you did notice me. Okay. So now has apparently noticed me as well. Let the staircase up. Not gonna help us. Hmm. There's a public terminal again, probably the same information. With what is the order for 745? Effective immediately, the traditional selection process for our series hereby entered. In lieu of a yearly election, a citizen will be chosen one month prior to the start of his or her term with our mainframe's random number generator, ensuring complete in Partiality and fairness. Ha. Huh. Shit. 
I forgot about this. But who would have set up that bomb? Why would anyone has to have set up me the bomb? We will keep looking, we need spare parts from here. Oh, another survivor. Not a long time survivor, that's for sure. They Did they push the counter next to the wall when things went poorly? I think there must have been some sort of a riot. What is this box? Just a lunch box. Oh, never mind then. I think I need that one. That was an I don't think I need that one. By the way, just in case my accent once again betrayed me. Alright, checking the terminal. What do we have? Deceptively. Nope. Rectangular. Desperately? No. Well. A level is replenished, so what do we have? We tried deceptively, rectangular, desperately. Uh, personality? No. Threatening? No. Uh, temporarily? Yeah, okay. That's the benefit of having your allowance replenished and some dots removed. Just go ahead and click everything through. Disengage lock, thank you. Here. That surprised me, Rex. Okay, whiskey, nuke, pulse mines, missiles. It's like they were preparing for a war, or maybe they were set up to. Be Start a war in their own complex just because you know to prove that the democratic way is the right way. The democratic way actually needs democracy for it to be democratic. Whatever. Okay, come on. We got there. Here we go. Wait. Let's go this way. Hello, Mantis. You're dead. I'm sorry, but I hope you don't mind. Funny cabinets with ammo. Not the sort of ammo we need there. Ammunition boxes with ammo. The same argument as before, I think. Security terminal. Uh, the position excerpt from the deposi deposition of the defendant Catherine Stone by Walt Attorney Gerald Hi Miles. Okay, let's pick up where we left off, Kate. Catherine. So, right, Catherine, I keep forgetting. My husband calls me Kate. You were telling us of a discussion you allegedly had with Roy Cotlip of the Justice Block. Not allegedly, had. We've been through this. It's still your word against his. Stone, but please, the discussion. He said my husband's name had come up in their meetings. The candidate endorsement meetings? Yes, they were going to endorse him. He wouldn't say why, but I know my husband had an irregular poker game with some of them and he'd been on a winning streak lately. And according to you, what did Mr. Gottlieb offer? He said he could sway his block, prevent the endorsement, but only if I. Only if you what, Catherine? Only if I. Only if you perform sexual favors? Yes. Was this just for Mr. Gottlieb? No, all the block leadership, their friends. And you agreed? What else could I do? They had a majority. How long did this go on before the endorsements came out? I don't know, a month maybe? And when they came out and your husband was endorsed despite your supposed agreement, was that when you decided to kill members of the block? Yes, I thought the majority is pretty slim. If I did things out a little, especially in the leadership, someone else might get elected. Assuming you weren't caught. No, Mr. Miles, I expected to be caught. That was my best chance. Now they elect me. They confessed murder. You think voters would be willing to risk putting you in charge? They had to pick some, but then live with the reasons. Yes, but wait and see. Wait, what? So 
So what did they do with the overseer once the overseer session ends? Does the overseer serve until the end of his or her life despite the fact that it's only a year in the term? Because that's what it sounds like. Why the not on the sounds like? Goodbye, Rat Head. Okay, this is the overseer's office. Let's prove our money. Suitcase with relaxed fare. Uh, which reminds me, how's my armor doing? Probably not too badly because of the whole situation where. Keep doing things. Spotted. Where's a key? Okay, Rex found something. And he's gone. This way is blocked off. So we might as well follow Rex. But where did Rex go? Because he did kill the rat on the way. The rat on the way had not noticed him. Oh, shit. I think this place was a major battleground. I'm not even sure what happened here yet. Okay, let's drink up some sarsaparillas. Maybe we should also mend these legs. Yeah. Okay, and then I'll call it there for the day. And thanks for watching. I'll see you next time. Hello, rat. Well, now he knows what happens to rats. Don't betray the family.